do plants get pain when we kill and cut them if you are a student of biology you will be able to answer well i am not a student of biology i have never really studied bi- biology in great detail but yeah well i have some some understanding of biology it is i was in, indeed fascinated with biology at, at a certain point in time especially zoology botany was a little boring for me but yeah this is in botany but let me try and explain so we know that plants have an internal structure we have something called vascular plants vascular plants are those plants that uh, transport uh, fluids and uh, various other uh, tissue uh, whether uh, various other nutrients etc from the roots into the various extremities of the plant so they have an internal vascular structure similar to the veins and arteries we have to some extent Okay, that's a rough approximation. It's not the right approximation. It's a rough approximation. So, if you look at the cross section of a plant, then you have the epidermis, which is the outer hard part, which is basically dead cells. Then inside one layer deep, you have the sclerenchyma tissue, which is the supporting tissue, which makes plants hard and stiff, etc. Which is made up of cellulose and lignin and such materials. Then inside you have two kinds of transport t- tissue, which is xylem and phloem and at the very core of the plant you have a soft tissue which is called the pith which is made up of parenchyma and it contains starch and various other nutrients so we know that this is the way transportation happens inside plants and plants are definitely sensitive to external stimuli not the way we are plants don't have muscles so they can't move in real time but if we observe a time lapse of a plant then you see that it does uh you know move around it does respond to the external environment uh, uh certain plants follow the path of the sun because that's where the sunlight comes from they need it for photosynthesis so they do respond to external stimuli that is a fact and it is known that plants do respond to music also this is also an observed fact that has been corroborated by multiple studies so there is some sort of awareness if you could call it that of the external world and there is some sort of responsiveness to what's happening outside and we know that plants also compete with e- with each other in a forest and they try to avoid each other's uh, regions each other's uh, zone of uh, p- each other's personal space so to say in forests and jungles etc so there is some sort of awareness now i don't know whether we, c- we should call it consciousness of or awareness or what would we would call it and we don't know for sure what they feel whether they do feel pain or not if we cut them because nobody has really tried to investigate this in detail people even see say that uh, that certain animals like crustaceans and lobsters and 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 shrimps etc don't feel pain well that is a lie because you can see the response to hot water people unfortunately boil lobsters and crabs and shrimp alive for the sake of cooking right so you do see the response to that sort of uh, stimulus they do feel pain you can see that that frantic response so similarly it is possible that plants may also have that sort of sensation if you could call it that but there is uh, a lack of uh, scientific studies in this in this field so we cannot say for sure but it would be i would say it would be naive to say that they don't have any sensations because they do respond to an, to external stimuli they do respond to the environment around them so it is possible that they may feel pain when we kill them or cut them etc but well that is the nature of life you have to eat other life forms in order to stay alive that's always been the nature of life on this planet especially when it comes to multicellular organisms certain unicellular organisms are able to uh generate energy and nutrients from the environment without uh without eating or or preying upon other life forms but in the case of large multicellular life forms like us we have to eat other organisms in order to survive so that that is unfortunately a fact of life so if they do feel pain well that's just the way it is so it is possible yes that they feel pain possibly